there, I'm Allie Dazzel for We Are Memory Keepers and I'm excited to share some tips with you for using the marker airbrush. This item is part of our basic tools collection and allows you to stretch your markers and get a lot more use out of them. You can use it with any size or style marker and all you need to do is remove your cap, stick it into the holder. You're going to turn this adjuster and just tighten that marker in there so it's nice and secure. Make sure your tip extends over the edge of the nozzle and then you're ready to squeeze. So much fun and so easy to use. There's no cord, no batteries, so it's a great tool for on-the-go crafting. And I'm going to go ahead and show you how to use this combined with some stencils to get a really pretty look on your projects. I'm using the heat wave stencil and I'm going to use that nice amber sand design. And in order to avoid getting excess ink on my project, I'm just going to cover up some of these other designs with some post-it notes. All right, so we're ready to start spraying. And I like to use the darker color marker first, so I'm going to go ahead and put some of this color on there. All right, now just to switch out markers, all you do is turn that tension screw and switch them out. And we're going to go to the medium color next. Pop that in, get the tip right there, tighten it up, and squeeze. All right, let's switch to the lightest color. And I like to use analogous colors. Those are colors that sit next to each other on the color wheel. Um, I think that creates a really pretty look. What's cool with this kind of a project is you can cut that out and add it onto a card. You can add it onto a scrapbook page. You can cut it out to make its own embellishment. You can use it with stickers, with die cuts to get a negative stencil effect. You can use watercolor with it for a layered mixed media look. Or you can use it all on its own and it looks awesome. It's really fun to use so go grab a marker airbrush and give it a try. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time.